Hello beautiful ones, welcome back to my channel. I hope that you have had a lovely week and that you are excited about kicking off this lovely holiday season. If you're new here, my name is Leisha and I've been documenting my own personal leveling up journey, which is where I'm discussing and sharing my experiences with personal improvement, um, also with elegance and working on bringing more affluence and wealth into my life. So if you would like to follow along this journey, please subscribe. I typically upload every Sunday. This week I am going to be sharing with you a bonus video which is my holiday gift guide for 2021. I have already started to get most of my shopping done because our baby is actually due right around the Christmas holiday. So I wanted to go ahead and put together some ideas for you to think about this season that will hopefully help you with your gift giving endeavors. Most of the gifts on this list can be found online to some extent, but I would also love to encourage you to shop local and to shop small businesses. Several of these items you should also be able to find at your local small business, whether it's a boutique or it is a market of some sort, uh, I would really encourage you to support businesses in that way this year. But of course, I will also have several of these linked down below for those of you who are all about convenience and shopping on Amazon or having things delivered to your front door, even to the person that is on your list this year. The first gift idea that I would like to share with you is actually something that we are gifting most of the couples in my family this year, just because these are are, I think, very elegant gifts to give, and they are great for both a male and a female to enjoy together at home, or a, I think some people call these gift hampers, perhaps. Um, we actually picked up this one, which is shrimp and grits, which is a Southern favorite. It's almost like a Southern delicacy here in the South for any time of year, but this is a shrimp and grits kit that we purchased from one of our local farmer's market, and we'll be sending this to um, one of our favorite couples in our family. Um, but you can also find some really nice baskets or bo boxes like this on Williams-Sonoma. That's one of my favorite places to find different themes from they have pancakes for Christmas morning they have cookies hot chocolate themed even different types of cocktails that you might have someone in mind for um, these are really I think elegant gifts to give and they come wrapped up so nicely already so you can uh, actually on Williams Sonoma ship them directly to the couple that you're gifting them to I really do think that these are fabulous gifts to give this year if you want to give something that's more of a cozy experience for in the home to be enjoyed and experienced together this holiday season. Something to keep in mind is that there are lovely gifts out there that you may want to gift for yourself or you would like to ask someone that you love to give to you for this holiday season. And one of my favorites that I have had this whole entire year and have gotten a lot of wear out of and would actually like to have in every color is my Teddy Blake bag here. This is actually the Ava Croco Gold style um, in the cognac leather color. They make absolutely gorgeous quality luxurious Italian leather handbags at a fraction of the designer price. In fact, there is a sale going on right now if you would like to take a look that this is their best deal of the year. I'll have information down below. Um, but I have really enjoyed this bag and got a lot of compliments on it when I wear it out. So if you're looking for something to gift, maybe your mother, your friend, um, or someone else that's very special to you on your list that's looking to level up their handbag selection at just sort of a price that won't break the bank but will still give you the quality that you want to have. Um, Teddy Blake has just such a lovely variety of classic streamlined styles. So um, I've really, again, enjoyed this bag for quite a while now. So wanted to go ahead and throw this on the list as well of ideas for you to gift to someone who wants to add something special like this to their wardrobe. The holidays is one of the coziest times of year and so I really think that a pair of slippers are a fabulous gift idea and they come across all different price points, different levels of quality. So if you are going to be gifting a pair of these, you can use your own spending plan accordingly. Uh, these are actually a pair of Ugg shearling slippers that my husband recently got for me 
and I just I love wearing them just in the house I don't wear them out um, but I really love wearing these to keep my feet warm and supported throughout the day and also of course to curl up with um, on our sofa here and in the evenings together they keep my feet warm and just it's just such a nice feeling to have something that I really wouldn't have gone out and purchased these for myself necessarily. I typically just wear the the normal spa slippers around or just my socks in the home. Um, so those are a really nice gift to give. You can also pair these with a luxurious robe. You can pair them with a spa kit if you wanted to do a basket. I think last year I talked about putting together little spa baskets and how much that is just that's an appreciated gift for someone to be able to use at home um, and so that's something you consider giving is just a nice little pair of cozy slippers for the holiday season you may or may not have someone like this on your list but what do you gift someone who is really focused on their fitness and wants to create more of a home routine i absolutely have been loving these bala bars that i purchased recently for working out at home and just doing sort of light uh, weights with my yoga practice and my pilates routines i'm doing some very light prenatal routines right now but these are three pounds i think they're so cute I got the bright pink color. Um, these are again the Bala bars. And so perhaps you wanna put together a little fitness basket or a little wellness basket for someone on your list, which you could do with a variety of different products and different uh, price points. I also have in mind a yoga strap. So this is really important to me for staying limber, for stretching um, and working on some of my yoga poses. This helps me to touch my toes right now with a nine month pregnant belly um, and then I also have a yoga block so again a, a pink yoga block I think that's really fun just to put together an at-home really simple workout um, kit or basket these are kind of essential so if you know someone who is planning in January to start working on some of their at-home fitness routines I think these are really great I actually will sometimes just listen to a podcast or um, sit here and and lift these just really simply with um, simple movements while I am watching a show on TV or something watching YouTube um, and so highly recommend these these are really great quality and actually just so cute to have as part of your at-home fitness kit I can't make this a gift guide without mentioning that you know if you know someone on your list that is working on some self-improvement books are always I feel like a welcome item to receive for the holiday and I think that again you can find them in really a local bookstore or you can order them online and have them delivered to your recipient um, but books are just such a wonderful gift I, I will sometimes gift a cookbook I have gifted cookbooks in the past and written down the year that it was gifted and just something typically that made me think of what the person receiving it was really enjoying about cooking for example or a certain goal that they had that they were working on and a book that um, I noticed one day made me think of them and that goal that they're working on so don't forget that you can give some very practical but meaningful and thoughtful gifts in the form of a book now this is another high-end gift so I didn't want to leave it out though because if you are if you are someone who's looking for a gift for your daughter or for your mother, that's really, really nice um, to help them level up their hair care routine. A lot of you know that I love the Dyson Airwrap and I have done a few videos on how it has helped me with my hair care routine. In fact, I use this pretty much daily to, um, to just style my hair. It's such a quick way to get accomplished. the so styling, the drying, and it does so with very minimal damage. I'm extremely, extremely happy with this purchase. Um, and although it is a higher price tag, I think that it is well worth it and it will be something that um, hopefully, you know, they will be using daily as well. And so getting a lot of use out of it. Um, it's it, again, just such a nice gift 
to give. I had to mention it on this list because I have absolutely loved it. And this was, this color was actually a limited holiday edition, I think from last year. So I'm not sure if you, um, if you look around, if they still have them in stock, the, this year's limited edition colors might be available still, but you can always just go with the regular Dyson Airwrap with the full kit that has all the attachments and everything that she needs to get herself a leveled up hairstyle at home. Now, another gift that I feel like is just so classy and elegant to give is a personalized journal with a very elegant pen that you can put together and you can even write a meaningful note to go along with it. As many of you know, if you've been here for a while, I am such a, an encourager of journaling practices for any lady who really cares about keeping her life organized and her mindset just on point. Um, I think that journaling is such a wonderful practice to add to your routine every day. So it's nice to have a, a nice journal to write in if you are making it a daily practice or working on making it a habit. I actually do really enjoy um, just a hardcover journal like this that's got some linen on it. It's got, of course, the the ribbon for marking your place. You can also find journals that have prompts in them that are thoughtful and make it a little bit easier to get the get those thoughts out of your head every day. So wanted to mention that and it's it goes an extra mile if you get it personalized. The next gift idea that I wanted to share are these very elegant jewelry organizers that I found on Pottery Barn. And I just think that these would be such a beautiful addition to the top of her dresser or inside of her wardrobe. Some of you saw my wardrobe update recently that I did where I have a, I have a jewelry organizer on one of the shelves there, but I actually really love these from Pottery Barn and I've been looking into getting one for myself. So this is actually on my list this year. I don't currently have it yet, but um, I just think these are elegant. They come in these uh, taupe colors and you can get them personalized. You can get the travel size jewelry organizer or you can go all out and gift the full on set of this organizer. I, again, I think that it's just beautiful. It's sleek. It's it's clean, it's elegant, and uh, what lady would not want to level up her jewelry organizer and presentation um, with this beautiful organizer. Now the last physical item that I was going to recommend as a gift idea is another sort of high-end item, but I think that it is well worth it and I've been loving it lately, and that is my Nespresso Virtua machine. It makes a fantastic cup of espresso or coffee and as my husband describes it it is just smooth he absolutely loves the coffee and he's really more of a latte drinker not just having his black coffee um, so highly recommend this gift especially if there's a couple in your life that needs a a coffee maker or would like to have a very convenient coffee maker at home. Um, I actually really enjoy making my Nespresso coffees at home compared to some of the coffee shops that I have frequented very um, much so every week. You know, it's nice to go out and get coffee, but this is a really, really nice way to make your own cup at home. Um, and you can even recycle the pods. So if you're also concerned about sustainability and things like that, Nespresso does take the pods that you've used and they will recycle them, which is really neat. So um, we actually did also purchase their Nespresso advent calendar, and that could make a very nice combo gift as well if you um, if you've seen these or if you just want to purchase the, the pods themselves to go with the Nespresso machine again we really love it I think it's such a nice gift to give if you've got someone on your list who maybe has recently moved into a new home or they love to host and want to have a nicer espresso option but not necessarily go all out with the barista machine um, this is a wonderful way to to give that to someone who's a coffee lover on your list now last but not least i really wanted to mention this as an idea because this is uh, a year where i feel like we have had a little less focus on 
perhaps getting out of the house and doing things. But I also understand that not everyone is ready to go out and go to events and things like that. But I really want to focus on gifting more experiences to the people that I love on my list and doing so through maybe a cooking class, for even if it's just an online cooking class that you purchase, um, or gifting them something like a pair of tickets to go see a show or tickets to a museum, a ticket that they've been wanting to go to for a long time that has maybe just reopened. Um, there are so many ways that you can gift experiences for those on your list that you know really don't need more things. I actually think a lot of us probably don't need more things to clutter up our homes with, but I understand that a lot of us, we enjoy receiving gifts that are tangible, um, but experiences and memories are so special and I really want to I want to be able to give more experiences to those in my life and share those experiences with them. So that was something that I wanted to mention as a really great idea, um, even for children, gifting them experiences that they can go and do um, maybe like a lesson if you pay for uh, like a piano lesson or gifting them the experience of going to a zoo or an aquarium or something like that together with their family. Um, that's just a really nice way to gift something again that is not going to just be taking up space but will create a memory that lasts hopefully um, longer than just uh, a, a regular gift would and another tip that i would say is that you know we have really wanted to start documenting more of our uh, experiences privately in fact recently i made a photo book for from our baby moon to costa rica via the artifact uprising website it's super simple i'm not affiliated with them or anything but this is this is the way that i've chosen to start documenting our trips and our year together rather than um, posting everything out in the open on social media i really am liking the tangible photo books when it comes to remembering our experiences rather than just posting everything online for all to see it's nice to have that it's just a little private keepsake so Hope that you like that idea. Let me know what you think in the comments below. And that, my lovely ladies, is going to wrap up this year's holiday gift guide. I hope that this left you with some ideas if you are just starting out some of your holiday shopping this year for everyone on your list. Let me know down in the comments below which one was your favorite. Um, if you have any other ideas that you would like to share with the ladies here in this community, I would love to hear those as well. And don't forget to check the description box for links to everything and information on where you can find some of the similar items, if not the exact items item that I just shared and talked about with you. If you haven't seen one of these videos here on my channel and caught up yet, um, please head over there. And until then, I will see you in the next video. Thanks so much for watching and wishing you a happy holiday season. Bye.